guys, it's me, Shifty TA, back with another video. Today we're going to do the Lego Marvel uh, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 uh, Baby Rocket ship. Um, they has Rocket and Baby Rocket right here. Uh, it shows you the Guardians teams that you get in the sets. Uh, there's Groot, Star Lord, Nebula, Mantis, Drax, and Rocket Raccoon. This is the ship that he um, travels in as a baby. I've seen the film, so I won't spoil the film, so you guys can watch it. Lego Marvel 8 Plus 76254. Uh, Marvel Studios, uh, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2. I, I feel like I said that again, but yeah. Um, yeah, it shows you a comic like and showing you the minifigures, Lego Marvel, big, center, then Lego Marvel again, title, different languages, picture of Rocket, the scale of him, more comic, just more information, so you can get Lego and its number. The back shows um, Rocket's, the Guardians of the Galaxy symbol, um, shows you Rocket, and shows you that you can shoot out stuff so it opens from here has two things that stick out the jet boosts yeah and then they go in its set number yeah so oh I'm sure. and then there's the barcode if you want to look it in some stores and shops yeah and then yeah so let's get started. So first we're gonna open the box. So I wonder if you guys have seen the Guardians films or if you like the others um who's your favorite guardians member so we have bag three here we have bag one bag two and let me just get out the other stuff out from there So it also has a good size uh, instruction booklet. And I think I'm not sure if it has stickers. Yeah, I'm not sure. Yeah, move the box out the way. So if we move the bag back, and then we can see the ship comes baby rocket, rocket side, where you can win. And I like these what Lego do. So it shows you like the progress of how long you've been. So bag one we're doing that, bag two, oh sorry, and bag three. So yeah. And then it tells you all the number pieces if anything's missing from the set. Yeah, that happened to me once. So yeah. Um so yeah, I wonder, like, do you even like Marvel? Well, you probably would if you're watching this video. But, yeah, I'm not sure. So yeah, let's just open bag one. Just wait a sec.
So the video that I posted a month ago at the Nova's game house in Lego Friends, that got a copyright. I'm not sure why. But yeah. So, should we get started? Um, first one to do the subscribe before the um, speed build. In three, two, one. Eh. Okay. Uh, so yeah, let's just get started. Ready? Okay.
I have now finished the set. Um, it is quite cool. Um, but the only thing is that the this area, uh, it's quite like, um, uh, there's like too much studs, like clean, because it's like clean here. No studs, uh, may, like some studs there, but there's quite a lot here, and you know, it's kind of um, a bit, mm, they could add like either tiles, more of these, uh, uh, pieces and across yeah um yeah and this is uh, quite cool i must say um so let's do the characters okay mm. let's put that aside okay so in bag one we got um baby rocket uh, in his mini form if you've seen the film uh, or in the trailers uh, it shows him and he's quite cute you only see this for a bit it's not a main part of the story but yeah it's still in the story but they should add like um, in here like the main villain the um, high evolutionary it would have been good but yeah, uh, it's like a Lego Friends piece where the hole is to put accessories in. But it's cool to get a rocket in this. this. I've actually, this is the last set. I've got all the sets from Guardians 3 now. So yeah. I got... And then in back two you get Rocket Raccoon. So his weapon is basically... I think a cone piece and a dual gu gun and you just stick it on top to make it larger he has the brown fur brown tail and has the same torso as every other guardians characters except great like the main uniform and he just uses navy uh, mini legs which don't live they're all just one piece see if we put them aside let's see this so if you look in the inside it shows a place to put rocket a baby rocket and you could put don't know if you can see it let me just move the light yeah Ooh. sorry i'm not the best at lighting but there's like four studs, two by two amount of studs to place a rocket. I noticed the uh, that piece, uh, the controls are the same piece in last year's uh, Zane's, in Ninjago Zane's um, uh, golden jet. Yeah. Um, so yeah. And then if we look on these like a little like a jet boost so two here same on the other side um more like tiling and quite clean a stud there and yeah um i think in the uh, speed build you see me mess up a bit but yeah and then yeah and then he uses the circle for like two b then in the stick, I like this little end, and then just like quite skinny and quite bare. He uses those rigid joints, so yeah, so it can be stuck in that position. These are used from just like, I think, take it off. Yeah, it's just used by, um, yeah um i'm not sure what they're called but it's like a uh, one and it's quite long but yeah uh nice tiling but i thought that was a bit odd it should have been like either orange that would have been better and this to be orange and orange orange just to give more contrast uh it has a bullet shooter with a green piece uh the new ones 
and it there's there some um, uh, blades at the back a wing here that can move with a rigid joint oh yeah <sighs> there. and then uses some tiling pieces different types yeah then he uses the hood piece of a car here they use it quite often here like the three places uh so yeah they can also move like that uh yeah same on the other side a little mini just jet boost and yeah that's it it's on the bottom it's pretty good it's okay i don't mind but yeah and this is how it shoots just pull press them down yep so yeah quite cool yeah and then rocket his weapon and the uh, spare pieces that come in the set there's quite a few um yeah most of them are like bullets not like the green i believe i just dropped one yeah so there are three of these spare but I just dropped one on the floor but yeah um comes with the orange cheese piece uh a tile orange tile an orange square stud turquoise stud uh, those technique pieces a little lever for a gun um i think it's like the semi oval type piece on one of those clips so yeah they're all good so yeah so uh, I cleared everything and got all the characters from the Guardian sets and it's pretty good collection. There's Mantis, Adam Warlock, uh, Nebula, Drax, Star Lord, Groot, Rocket Raccoon and Baby Rocket. So I won't discuss about these a lot but I would oh sorry mantis so yeah i'll show you a review so uh the top if i take mantis's hair off um yeah uh so then it has um same torso as rocky don't need to do that um it has the same face as athena and since she's used it before even in the fountain in the what was it called um the Benatar and has some printing on the legs uh, some red lines has some like dark printing and some boots so yeah her and they have um grey arms yeah all of them do then she uses her mask that she uh, hair that she always uses with the antennas which are always sometimes off color but yeah and it's a rubbery hair piece that they're still doing that so yeah we talk about adam warlock he is a new character and he's all gold so there's some red got a skull there got some armor plating on it you can see all that detail has some red boots and it's not door molded has gold arms and the gold um hair that chris pratt uses so yeah and uh, he uses dark red arms hands and he uses a um a um the softer cape in dark red 
and some detail did i talk about the detail at the back no okay oh it's hard to take rubber pieces off see it's just more uh, the belt some little um straps and yeah So yeah, and then yeah, so his back printing has just some more detail. Yeah. So yeah, this is pretty cool. I really like it, and it has his uh, little stone in his head, like vision. And yeah, he has dual face, one smiling, one serious. And Mantis had months angry. And one not so angry, just normal expression. Nebula has the same outfit as uh, Mantis and all the rest. Um, she has great arm hands, has a metallic uh, silver arm. Yeah, uses a blue head, like a traditional blue head, but like a navy in the middle. And a lighter around some mechanical focus some mechanical parts at the back and she doesn't have the gold but yeah if we go to tracks instead of using the gray now they're using the uh, like sand green but yeah he has just like a uh, red face marks and he's pretty serious some more tattoos at the back and yeah Chris Pratt, same hair, it's normal, and same face, like a smiling to a serious face, same as the Jurassic World one, and, sorry, Chris, oh sorry, um, Peter, and yeah, he, uh, Groot, he has the same torso and legs from, sorry, um, it has the same torso and legs from the um, Benatar, the uh, the Infinity Saga one, and yeah, quite a lot of detail and detail on the back. And he has a new expression, more older, more grown. Has some armor to represent his spikes on his back, or spikes on his shoulders, and the face expression more serious. And has some green growing from the top like moss so yeah this is one of my favorite but i think they should have done either a gamora or the um high evolutionary because that would have been better so yeah look those two characters those two or craglin or cosmo they would have been good inclusions but yeah but Thank you for watching, hope you can like and subscribe down below, uh, please turn notifications on and yeah, uh, hopefully I'm going to release this video out soon and another video soon for you guys and yeah, uh, see you in my next video, bye.